this video we're going to show you how you can configure iWatch DVR uh, so you can log in basically into your 32-way DVR and uh, view you know live streams of what's going on okay so first of all you have to download it from the app store and you get a little icon like this and we just press into it okay so the first thing that comes up is DVR list and we've not added it here so we'll press the plus symbol then to add Sorry, to add something. So we can call the DVR name whatever we want. So I'm just going to call it DVR32. Okay, just for argument's sake. So the host is the IP address. So obviously we're not going to give you our IP address. So what you would have done is you would have contacted your broadband provider and asked them to provide you with a static IP, okay? Some providers like Vodafone will give business users one static IP free. Others may charge a small fee. So, you know, what you'd enter in here is, you know, one more one, you know, whatever it comes out as. You know, so easy peasy, okay? So the port for this is 8100. Okay, so press done. And the username by default is admin. Okay, and the user or the password by default is one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and that's it. And then you can just go save. And then you'll be able to view your videos uh, or you know your live streams from your DVR um, over your mobile phone. Now, what I should say is. Um, Obviously, your IP address would be different, so um, you'll just have to work that out with your um, your broadband provider and try and get a static IP and things like this. But that's basically, in a nutshell, how you configure um, iWatch DVR uh, to view your uh, live streams remotely from your mobile phone.